Hello everyone, uh, V-Ray here. Today we're going to focus on chamfering and filleting an object in Blender. Now I've already opened up a project file for this lesson. Um, you'll notice there's four cubes. Uh, this cube has what I refer to as a chamfer. And this cube has what we refer to as a fillet. So I have two other cubes um, to work from. So let's go ahead and start with the cube that we're looking at here. We're going to create a chamfer first. The first thing you're going to want to do to access the cube, you're going to want to click tab. That's the tab button. Okay. The tab button takes you into edit mode. From here, you're going to want to press control tab. That takes you into mesh select mode. You have the option of choosing between vertex, edge, or a face. In this case, we want to choose edge. Holding down the shift button, select one edge, the next edge, the next edge, and the next edge that will contain your chamfer. Type control B, that's control B as in boy, control B, and pull. Okay, this will allow you to create the chamfer length of your choice. Once you decide on a certain length, go ahead and pull and stop. Tab to exit. And you have your chamfer completed. Okay. Fill it. Same process. Select the cube. Press tab. Control tab, select edge, holding down shift, select your edges, all the way around, control B, as in boy, pull, now this time, Instead of pulling and, re and releasing, what we're going to do is use the mouse scroll wheel to subdivide the face or the faces. So what I'm doing is I'm using, if you can see here, and I'm going to just get out of here and I'm going to zoom in a little closer so we can see that there. Okay. So once again, we're select, holding down shift. I'm going to select my edges. Type control B. I'm going to pull, and then I'm going to slowly scroll my mouse button up and down, forward and backwards. And you'll notice as I do that, I can add in as many subdivisions as I want to those faces, giving me a nice round edge as I apply more. Click, press tab to get out of the, the uh, mode. And voila.